up? It's your girl, Miss Parker from Hard Body Entertainment. And we're going to get into some entertainment news, man. That dude, Takashi 6 9 and this whole Chief Key thing, the dude, cool to be, cool to brown, whatever, he locked up. He didn't admit it. You know that. Takashi 6 9 hired him to do this thing, man, all behind the Chief Key clout chase when he was out in jail. He knew he was weak. He knew if he ever got caught, he was going to cooperate. I don't know why this man decided to hire somebody to shoot somebody. It's like he a whole Justice Smollett lie. He got to go back to It's just crazy. He got to go back to the holding cell and think about something dumb. Something else he did. Like, this is what happens when you clout chase. This is what happens when you clout chase. You know, this is what happens when you stupid for that gang gang mess, trying to clout chase, trying to troll, trying to be the top of the scene. Then you got to go wreck. You're not doing G things when you're a rat, bro. You're just not doing it. Hard body ENT, you know what I'm saying? You're not doing rat things and snitching. I had a dude fake snitch on me the other day, told the judge that I was his heroin dealer. I don't even know why the judge didn't even get him. How you gonna be on heroin and then you you loan me some money for the show? He ain't even get it. You still lost anyway, hard body ENT. Just like Joe Button over here losing, man. That whole thing leaked with him. Supposed to have been doing this for TV, you know, the whole breakup with Sin Santana. I mean, it's a lot of dudes out here perpetrating the fraud. They'll do anything for clout, too. These men out here, they'll mess with women. I mean, they always been players. That's why you got to always keep your A-game on. Anytime a nigga come to me and he got something going on, definitely I'm going to be looking to see what he got going on to see how I can incorporate with what I got going on to see if we really got something going on. And then at the end of the day, if we don't got nothing going on, guess what? I got me some promotions. I got me some things going on. Because I done had some dudes come to me, you know, looking at my position and situation and stuff. Oh, they be coming with the shit. That's why I met the dude, you know. But hopefully since Santana, you know, in this whole situation, I heard, heard Mona Scott had to put the gag order on him. He was talking too much. So we'll see how this plays out in front of TV, man. But just know, do your own thing. Hard body NT. I'm always doing my own thing. Don't let these people try to take nothing from you like these people trying to take the Crips, trying to take from this Nipsey hustle. And this marathon, I can't even talk. This marathon continues. That's crazy, his slogan. He done worked his whole life for that. Black Sam out there fighting for that man. That's his brother. We seen, you know, at the funeral how Black Sam felt about his brother. And he ain't going to let it go down that easy. You know, they fought together. They fought hard and they fought long. He's not going to allow. They already took his brother from him. And now he realizing and seeing that. That gang gang mess ain't all of this. They was jealous of my man. They was jealous of him. You know what I'm saying? And now they out to get anything they can to make money off his name, even his baby mama out there. That's why you got to watch who you gang bang with, watch who you lay down with, and situations like that. If you can't do it on your own, if you can't do it by yourself, don't do it, baby. Don't set yourself up like that. Watch the baby mamas that you decide to lay down with because all of them ain't and king. She out here fighting, going back and forth with custody. She don't even take care of other kids. You know what I'm saying? Just like I say, people be clout chasing. I seen uh, the real black China about to hide. And, you know, I think that it's time for us to see this again because it's a lot of situations like this with mother and daughter. I'm so glad that, you know, my mother and my relationship has healed and we've come through. But I think, you know, TV needs something that's real and raw like this. Just to see how mothers and daughters are. You know, it's a lot of mothers that are jealous of their daughters and don't want to see them go far and different things like that. And I think that's one of the situations here with China and her mother. So, you know, that's going to be a good show, a good segment. And let's, you know, let's start loving on each other. Hopefully, you know, with all of these things going on, people snitching, you know, the baby mamas. We see all of these things with Nipsey Hussle. You see when he died. He trying to stay, trying to steal people that he's rubbed all his life, the rolling 60s and the Crip 9s and all of that. Then went three days after that man died and trying to take over his thing, man. Let's let's take care of each other and take care of ourselves, you know. And lastly, speaking of taking care of stuff, I need my girl, man, Cardi B. Please, baby, please, please, please take care of yourself. I don't know what these feet is looking like. These feet look like that face you're making. Your feet hurt. 
Sit your butt down, man. Go ahead and get you somewhere. You're busting out your drawers. Your feet hurt. You need to take about 30 days off. But we give you permission, Cardi, to take 30 days off these feet. It's looking like that damn thing we used to watch on TV with the big head and sure was the mama. I forgot what it was, but this, it looked like these feet belong to him. I forgot what his name was, but it looked like your feet belong to that guy with the hair and sure was his mama on that movie we used to watch. Lay down. Go chill with culture. Put your feet on offset. Why he play the game? Just do something, Cardi. I'm, these feet, is they not... They bad, bad, Cardi. They bad, bad. They so bad, they got you busting out your drawers. You can't even squat. You can't do your twerk. What you gonna do when you can't twerk like you usually twerk for us now, Cardi? Lay your ass down. I love you, but lay down, okay? Y'all already know it's your girl, Miss Parker. Look out for that no smoke with me and Siobhan Cardi. Yeah, that jank going down. It's crazy. I appreciate, you know, all the love and support that I've been getting, man. And I'm gonna just keep living my life and... You know, whatever come my way, I'm going to use it like the foul heartbeats. You heard me? It's Heart by the ENT, www.missparker.com.